Also and the dogs are back home. Yeah, they're super happy to be back. They're mountain dogs, so mm -hmm. that's it's what they know. Sure. Town was a little challenging. Okay, boys, come on. Cool. The um, the fire came from over in Wall Street, which is that way, several ridges over, and. Um, Basically, I never thought it would get here. Um, I was here when the fire started mm -hmm. and uh, didn't leave until about 2 p.m. So the fire started about 10. I left at 2 and our house was ablaze at uh, 3.30. Wow. So and even when I left, I really didn't think that our house was going to go. So I just got one cart full of stuff, uh, just the most important stuff. And, uh, and that was about it. So um, pretty shocking, pretty abrupt. Um, but we kind of had to get over that pretty quickly and move on. So uh, we were fortunate to have good insurance coverage and they told us within a week what our budget was and we hired our architect two days later and we were off to the races. I come so. out here and pick vegetables. I'll help plant and I'll help pick, but everything in between. Uh, that's, that's me. That's well, me. I find gardening good therapy, so I yes, know what you mean. It's that been really that. helpful, healing to be able to work in the... Well, that's a nice one, too. It was built by the guy we bought it from, and it was built in 1990. Uh, unfortunately, new. lots and lots of, of exterior wood. You know, yes. Which was, you know, no one was here to witness this house going up, but we're pretty sure that what happened was embers coming ahead of the fire uh, landed on our overhanging decks and set the place on fire. So it burned really hot here. We were told by several of the fire chiefs that when they did the infrared photos that the fire burned hottest right here, right in this spot in sunshine. So because it came up that gulch, which mm -hmm. was just so intense. It's, there's so much life coming back and it's yeah. really happening really fast. It's amazing to see the kinds of things that take over first after a fire. I mean, that little slope behind you was eight inches deep of ash and we, we just never thought anything would come back mm -hmm. in there.